Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to build a C-sharp application that uses OCR, optical character recognition, to extract text from images. And we're going to do all of this with the power of Tesseract, one of the most popular open source OCR engines out there. If you've ever wanted to extract text from scanned documents, images, or even photos of signs, this is a video for you. So let's get started. Once your project is created, let's head to the NuGet Package Manager to add Tesseract to our project. Just open Tools, NuGet Package Manager, manage NuGet packages for solution. Then search for Tesseract and install the latest version. It should look something like this on your screen. Now that we've installed the Tesseract package, we need to set up the Tesseract data files. These files are crucial for OCR and contain the trained models for recognizing different languages. You can download the language data from Tesseract's official GitHub page. I'll link that in the description below. Let's jump into the code. Head to the program.cs file and start by adding the necessary codes. We'll initialize the Tesseract engine and configure with the path to our test data folder. We'll also define the image file we want to process. Here's the code to initialize Tesseract and load an image for OCR processing. We're going to pass the path to the image and set up the Tesseract engine with the location of the test data folder. As you can see, we're using the Tesseract engine to load the test data folder and specify the language we want to use. In this case, ung for English. We also load the image using pics.loadfrom file. I'm using an ID card image and a letter image for this demo. As you can see, the OCR engine has successfully extracted the text from the ID card. You can clearly see the name, ID number, and other details. Let's try another example with a letter image. This time, an image of a handwritten or printed letter. I'll update the path to point to the letter image and run the application again, even with the letter. Tesseract is able to recognize the text and print it in the console. However, keep in mind that OCR accuracy depends heavily on the quality of the image. For better results, especially with low quality images, we might need to apply some image pre-processing. Speaking of quality, if you're working with low resolution images or images that are a bit blurry, it might be helpful to pre-process them before running OCR. You can use grayscale conversion or thresholding to clean up the image and make text extraction more accurate. And that's it. You've now learned how to use Tesseract OCR in a C-sharp application to extract text from images like ID cards and letters. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more awesome tutorials like this. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop a comment below. I'm always happy to help out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.